Welcome everybody to another YouTube exclusive Voice of Nick episode. We're going to be doing more Super Seducer now and uh, I think we're trying to still get through the second portion. So let's see uh, if we can super seduce these ladies. Here we go. So we're oh, 21%. This is a this is a long one. Okay. So we're going to like speed run this part unless there's any interesting um, interesting things we haven't done yet. Recognize her from school. I don't think we've done this one. Let's give it a shot. Oh, 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 oh. it's you from school. How are you? Oh, what's your name again? Uh, Rebecca? No. Michelle? No. Uh, what was it? Remind me, remind me. Who's I don't know. No, we went to school I together. Don't, don't worry. I don't remember Yeah, you. we were that girl in class. You were like sitting in the back throwing things and stuff. I was not yeah, doing that. Yeah, it was definitely. What, no. What's your name again? Anastasia. That's it. I knew really? it. Really? Yeah, What is yeah. your name? Richard. You remember me? Anyway, it's cool. We went to school together. So <laughs> really? That's the nice thing. Are you going to introduce That's me to your friends? a little bit creep, you know? Creepy? Yeah, because you're sitting, coming up here, sitting yeah. next to us and saying, oh, look, telling us we babe, went to school together. Babe, we went to school for years together. So it's Hi, like don't we're call already... me babe, all right? So well, I don't really know you, you look know? Class, Do you mate. know this guy? Look class, mate. You know, we went to school for know, years. Please. Stop, stop being creepy and please oh, were leave you us. Were you at school with us as well? No, I think no. you were. No, no, no. no. Could you just believe us? Yeah, we're kind of in the middle of conversation. No. Well, now I'm in the middle of you. No, I don't think so. Mm, you're not very friendly, are you? No. It's kind of rude, isn't it? I'm just being Maybe. sociable. All right. I won't see you at the school reunion. <laughs> What's that? I don't know. Have you seen him anywhere? Yeah. No, I don't know. Such an old line, you know? That's so boring. You know? Such a creep. We should get out of here. I don't know. I don't like this place. Yeah, we should go. Too. You know how in court the lawyer never asks a question or says something that might lead somewhere that he's not prepared for? Well, it's the same like this. When you're giving her an opportunity to say no and dismiss you, it's usually a bad thing. So, bad choice. Wow. Never, I didn't think you'd bring up things that would happen in court. Okay, well, we're going to speed run through this part. We did this last did time. That's correct. Correct. So, how do you know each other? And then the business. I remember this one. I think this was the only one we could choose. We actually like went that. through every answer until we got You'll that. You'll notice that in And we didn't even mean to get so How long one. have you guys... All right, so now the best friends test is what they did that time. Oh, I don't think we did this one, the most beautiful eyes. Let's give it a shot. You know, I noticed you from over there. Oh, yeah? But, yeah, but when I got closer, I just noticed you have the most amazing eyes. Oh, that's so sweet. I've never heard that before. Oh, really? Great. Actually, I've heard many heard. times. Yep. Okay. <laughs> well, it must be true. Well, maybe. I don't know. You gave her a compliment that she's heard a billion times before. Try and think of something original and don't say it too early. <laughs> All right. I get, I get the, the logic of that, I guess. And if you tell Let's skip this, skip this. This will work. Speed running, baby. So what were you doing? Be playful how it's a little incongruent. Tell them about how you're a vegan. Oh, yeah, I think this is what, um, I think this is what we were up to. Okay, so here we go. Maybe, this seems a little, let's just tell them what we did. I want to do the vegan one. Let's do the vegan one. Ugh, you eat burgers. It's nasty, because that's like processed meat. It's carcinogenic. What? So what? I love meat. You're killing the poor little animals. I'm not killing anyone. Well, you're eating it and they kill it for you to eat. Yeah, but it's already dead. It's dead because you wanted it to be dead because you ate it because you provided the demand. I don't want anything to be dead. Look, I'm babe, just Listen, eating... darling, look. You studied economics, right? Supply, demand. You you demanded they killed a load of animals and they supplied it by killing the animals. All right? So think That's about awful that. awful thing you So say. you're basically a killer and you too. You don't get <laughs> off sitting there 
thinking it's all about her. So I'm just thinking you're killing the plants you're eating or what? <laughs> Come on. Plants are growing. The plants they drop. have soul maybe. I don't no, know. Don't. The plants drop the fruit and I eat the fruit as nature intended. And what you're doing just destroying so you the planet. Also no, eating listen. the dead fruit. You're destroying the planet. <laughs> Killing all the oh animals God. and making yeah, the world blah, terrible. Blah, I don't know. Another one, got... green pea stuff. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So I like green pieces. Yeah. Cool for Lettuce. You. Happy for you. Yeah. But what do you think? You want to be a vegan with me? No, I'm fine. Come tomorrow. To no. My, to my favorite no, vegan restaurant. No, thank you. No, I yeah, like so. to try new stuff, but no, no with you. No. Could have been worse, but people don't really like to be preached to, even if they know that you're right. You know, things about smoking, drinking, uh, eating fast food, whatever. They don't want to be told off about it. So if you, the only negative thing that might work is teasing. So try something different next time. Not the best option. How did that work? I, I, I can't imagine that that would be... The way that they reacted to that, that would not have been a half right answer. That would be a completely wrong... That was the most awkward. All right, focus on, okay, this one's obviously wrong. Give slightly more attention. Give both equal attention to the one you, let's say equal attention. Oh! This won't mess things up, but it's not the best course of action because you do want the girls to understand which one of them you like. They didn't even have so a what reaction What do you chicas like to do in your spare time? How about you? <laughs> Anya. I like to dance. You're a dance? Oh, don't say that about yourself. Mm. What did you say? I like to dance. Ah, dancing. Yeah, yeah. nice. Okay. What <laughs> yeah. else? And um, I go to the gym a lot. All right, cool. And how about you? Oh, I have so many interests. Um, I watch movies. I'm crazy about TV shows. I'm like yeah. a freak. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say. Funny. Mm -hmm. And I also like love playing with my dog. Ask if she means doing very inappropriate things with her dog. Say you, oh my god, how could you? S say that you like dog fighting. Say that it's sweet and that people with pets are generally more <laughs> This is so clearly, okay. This one couldn't possibly be the right answer. Say you have fish. Say you have fish is actually kind of a, a funny answer to give. I think that one could be correct as well. But uh, these two we gotta try. We gotta try. We, let's get this one out of the way first. Oh god. Well, I don't have a dog, but I do yeah. love sports with dogs. Oh, like, okay, um, have you seen this greyhound racing with the whippet dogs? Uh, and you yeah, can bet on yeah, it. They're really yeah. the fastest dogs, you know? Uh -huh. And what else? That? Oh, dog fighting. It's beautiful. What? Isn't it? dog you ever fight? been to a dog fight? No, I'm not planning to. Oh, we've got to do it. What, what species is your dog? Like, what breed? Um, he's like a German. German Shepherd? Yeah, but I, I rescued him from the street. Well, we can so rescue him and bring him to a dog fight. No, we can put him no, I didn't bull. rescue him for that. You think Whoa. he could beat a pit bull, rip it up, or he mm, would stop? God, no. Oh my God. You, I don't like this conversation. Can we just like end it. it up? End it? Yeah. Okay, you're going to go? No, you're going to go. Oh no, what? You've marked your territory. You've done yes, a wee-wee. Yeah. Wee -wee. So please go away. Well, what if I just piss all over the couch? Then it'll be my couch. <laughs> no, just go somewhere else. Actually, to do I will. That's disgusting. Yeah, yeah. Why okay, would you do fine. that? You're going to go fine. to the toilet like normal Whatever. people. Whatever. Can't believe you've choice. pissed on the couch. Whatever. Please don't try this at home. Don't try it in a bar. Don't try it in a club. Coffee shop. Public place non-public place okay we got that one out of the way i love how you tried to like ease into it like oh i like uh greyhound racing dog fighting you know all the all the things hey, with your dog. Yeah. Hey, hey. i or saw a video with stronger. i saw a video with exactly that title playing with my dog and it was basically this girl maybe no it wasn't you right but she mm. was she was sitting down and um the dog was there and yeah. the dog really likes honey so she put wow. some honey oh wow yeah. oh gross and That's then you can gross. guess what happens next so this is what you like to do in no, your free time no it's not i train my dog are oh, you training it to do that stuff <gasps> no! Well, you gotta make some videos. There's loads of money in this kind of shit now. Such a jerk! Well, what do you mean? Yeah. It's a business it's opportunity, so though. Oh my god! Even if it's what you were thinking, you don't need to say it. <laughs> Even if it's what you're. 
Is that what it's supposed to? Okay, so now these are two answers that I have thought could be correct. So I think this one's the more obvious one. So we're gonna go with say you have fish, which I think, if he says it right, could be a pretty funny joke. So you have a dog? Yeah, yeah. that's cool. I never had a dog. Um, I had a cat, they ran away. But anyway, mm -hmm. now I've got um, fish. Oh. I've got an aquarium. Okay. And in there, I don't know, I've got 24 fish. Wow. Um, some of them that's are like plenty. the schooling fish, where you have a few the same. And then I've got two of the clownfish, and they're finding Nemo. And then I've got three of the blue tang, like uh -huh. the blue ones. And they're really fast. They just race around. And they do this game where they take bubble from the top, bring it down, let it go. And then oh, how lovely. they go around. And I feed them like three times a day, but it's automatic. It has this okay. um, feeder, one with pellets and then one with flakes. That's very interesting. So, yeah, you man. know, tell me more. Right? Well, yeah, of course. So I've got some other fish. Actually, I might change their name. One can be called Anya. Uh, actually, one... wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I'm joking. You're joking? But yeah, let's you don't change like fish? the subject. Oh. Well, you'll like them when you see them. But okay, we can talk about something else. Okay. This is a rejection of her offer, if you use um, impro terminology from acting. Basically, she put out a subject, you know, you can go deeper into it, connect on it, talk about it. You blocked it, you talked about your fish. She might not care, might not have anything to say about it. If you do want to talk about your fish, save it until you've fully explored the subject relating to her, which in this case is her love of dogs. Listen, can you tell her to just stop talking so much? She's just talking all the time. Is she always like that? Oh. <laughs> no, I'm joking, she doesn't really say much. Yeah. Huh? But she's Hi. sweet. She seems very sweet. Yeah, she is. She's very really sweet. Nice. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> That's kind of a funny thing to say. I, okay. Here's what, he obviously didn't do the thing I thought he was going to do with the fit. Here's, ready? Oh, I like to play with my dog. What, you have a dog? Well, I have a more serious commitment because I, I have a fish. I have my own little bag. Blah blah. Tell me about your dog. That's what I thought he was gonna make a joke about how a fish is like equal commitment to having a, a you know regular animal pet, and then move on. <laughs> Instead, he described his twenty-four fish fish tank, which is not indicated in the description of this question. I wish it said like, tell them about your fish in extreme detail. That's what that should have said. It's not tell them about say you have a fish. Say you have a fish sounds like you're making a joke about your fish for like five seconds and then continuing to talk about her thing. Anyway, okay, now we have two options. It's like narrowing down. Get physical by checking her muscles. Ask where they see themselves in five years. These are two very different muscles, I guess. So you say you go to the gym, yeah? Yeah. And what about you? You do some stuff? Uh, just gym? do some jogging, you know? That's pretty Jogging? Nice. Yeah. Like when you steal someone's wallet and you run away? <laughs> that was a good one. Oh, something like that. Okay, wait, let me check your muscles. Oh, that's oh, not bad actually. Right? Compare? No, it's pretty weak, you know? <laughs> yeah. Wait, check this out. <laughs> Amazing, yeah? Like a rock. Oh, right. Actually, you want to check it? Check it. It's hard as diamond. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Cool. Amazing. Wow. This is always kind of playful and fun. Lots of girls will say they go to the gym and do stuff, and this is a nice transition from there. It allows you to get a little bit physical, and it usually brings out some smiles. So it's something you can try. Well done. It's the right choice. But you girls are in pretty good shape, so I think you must do more than jogging. You do some sports. Well, sometimes they play squash, but cool. not as often as I maybe wish. <laughs> okay, I play a little bit as well. Oh yeah? Mm -hmm. That's great. What else? Anything else? Uh, I used to play basketball when I was in college, yeah. but yeah, it was a long time ago. And <laughs> hmm, that's cool as well. Yeah. You watch the NBA anymore. or you don't watch it? Uh, I used to, yeah. I was crazy about it, but yeah, I have my job now and I don't have plenty of time, so... Mm -hmm. I don't watch it anymore All that right. often. Yeah. Didn't they just say that they were going to school? Do the strawberry fields routine. I okay. Do we have a guess what that is? Strawberry field. What would it sit in? I don't even know what this would be. Is it where? Okay, I guess it's got to be that he sings Strawberry Fields. Or like, do you know the lyrics to Strawberry Fields? Maybe. Is that the routine? I have no concept of what this could be. Show off. I also am very interested to see this, but I gotta see the Strawberry Fields routine. And the fact that it's like in quotes and it's 
such a you know unexpected thing means this has to be a real technique so it's probably going to be the right answer but i really want to see both of these we'll have to come back for show up because he likes psychology tests mm -hmm. things um, like that yeah i don't know yeah, yeah we can try well who yeah. doesn't come on i don't know it's interesting of yeah. course it is yeah have you done this one called strawberry field psychology test no okay Have try no. try this right now with me both of you okay? okay so maybe close your eyes it will help so close your eyes and you imagine you're walking in some beautiful place and then up ahead you see a field of strawberries and tell me um there's a fence around it how high is the fence just show me with your hands how high it is okay oh okay nice one all right that's enough and then yeah, you can put your hand on <laughs> and then uh, the next thing so you go in there and you want to eat some strawberries how many strawberries do you eat what's your answer I will eat as many as I can okay <laughs> and yeah how about you me too loads of strawberries yeah, okay strawberries ah but then you've eaten all the strawberries you're leaving and then the farmer comes mm -hmm. and he's like you ate all my strawberries and then what do you say back to him? I would just say, I'm sorry. <laughs> what would you say? I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> I was hungry. <laughs> okay. All right. You can open your eyes. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to tell you what it means, right? Mm -hmm. It's very interesting. So the first one, how high the fence is, that's your barrier to sex. Yeah. Like how open you are because strawberries represent passion and stuff okay. for a woman. So yours was kind of here, so it's like medium. Yours was really high, like a huge fence. So it means, you know, you're quite difficult to have sex with, basically. But anyway, you don't have to answer if that's true or not. But then the number of strawberries you eat is your sexual appetite. Okay! So some girls, maybe they say, oh, I always have like half a strawberry. And then she's like a girl that doesn't like sex. And then go have a few strawberries. But you, yeah. what did you say? You ate every strawberry in the world. Oh, uh, yeah, like, so. okay. <laughs> all I wanted. Yeah. And then the final thing is what you say after sex. So when the farmer catches you. So what do you say? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> and you say, I'm hungry. Yeah, you're hungry after sex, right? It's normal. Yes. Oh, oh, that's perfect. so funny. Seems perfect I, to I'm me. sorry. <laughs> I think that was dead on. Psychological <laughs> test win. <laughs> Whoa. Interesting. That was actually pretty funny. Now, if you can be bothered to learn this, it actually is another thing that works. Again, it's prepared, um, so it's not ideal. We don't want you to just learn a bunch of stuff and, and go out and repeat it. But if you do find yourself in a boring situation, you know, <laughs> a date that's not going so well, uh, talking to a girl and you think she's not that into you, why not have it ready? You know, it's quite interesting. And you can always just say it's a psychology test that you um, saw online, right? I'm sad it didn't so what do you guys to do? do? What about you, Anya? I have a fashion store. Oh, ah, yeah, selling clothes? Yeah. Nice. Um, <laughs> I don't work at the moment. Unemployed? Yeah. Yeah. Tell her to hire her friend to work for her making clothes. Okay. Say it's great that she doesn't work and that you're so jealous. <laughs> Try to hook her up with your friend Kareem, who can be her sugar daddy. Oh, well, I want to know more about Kareem anyway, so let's find out. Is he going to come into the scene? Okay, so you're not working. Okay, I've got the perfect solution. Oh. I've got a friend, yeah? His name is Kareem, and he's he's a little bit old, you know, like, but still okay. alive. Um, and he's a little bit, you know, like... Chubby, Chubby's being nice. So, but okay. Anyway, the main, the good thing, and this is very, very good, and it makes mm -hmm. up for everything, is that he's very, very rich. And so what? Well, have you ever heard of the thing uh, Sugar Daddy? So he, yeah. Okay, perfect. <laughs> so I've heard about it, looking, but I'm not interested. Well, he's looking Thank for a girl you. just like you. No, no, no. And we're no, talking no. about three thousand no, dollars a month. No, I'm sorry. That's... And wait, even better. You just need to fucking like two times. No. Oh, who? No. Check him no, out. Look. No, no. Let's let's there get is, out look. of here. I'm. Just, ah! Three thousand. Stop it. Yeah, no. three thousand dollars. No. Sorry, dude. I tried. <laughs> It's just not polite, is it? It could have been a funny joke, though. I feel like he, he takes these in such weird directions sometimes. Because he, he wants to point you towards the one that he's telling you to do, but I think he could have made that into a pretty funny joke as well. Okay. Um, this cannot be right. Tell her to hire her friend to work for her making clothes. This one also seems pretty, like, 
rubbing it in, kind of, but okay, let's go for that. Well, I'm sometimes unemployed, but it's booked by choice. So for you, like, you're, you're looking for something, or you're just... Uh, yes, I'm looking for something suitable for me, but... What's your dream job? I want to open a flower shop. Oh, that's nice. Because when, when you yeah. said I don't do anything, I just thought you were at home painting nails, nails and <laughs> like getting some no, food. No. And, <laughs> and you buy your own drinks and stuff. So, yeah, that's all right. You're still independent. Yeah. Trying to. This is a nice, just um, playful answer. Good one. You girls seem really nice, but do you have any bad habits? No. Drug abuse? No. no. Cigarettes? No. Ah, alcohol. Got oh, you. That's, that's not a bad habit. <laughs> cheers. No, no, cheers. Your liver's very happy with that. That's yeah. alright. Just watching them drink their drinks. Ask if the girl you like is a good girl. Ask if. Oh. Ask which of the girls. Oh. Okay. We got some options here. Here we go. Anya, you have a really honest face. I think you couldn't tell a lie. <laughs> yeah? So answer me this. How many drinks would it take for her to fuck, do you think? <laughs> Two what? or three? What? Four? Uh, impossible. Five? Impossible. impossible. Not for you, my friend. Come on, <laughs> how many? Just a few more and then she's like, mm, yeah, come no. to me, baby. No, just talk. No. You can talk. Yeah, I know. Yeah, right. Please. Don't bother us. Okay. So she's ready now. She doesn't need any drinks. Even if I was too drunk. Yeah, what would we do, babe? It would be good. I yeah? wouldn't have sex with you. You wouldn't? What would no. you do? Blowjob? <laughs> nope. Nothing. Zero. Kiss. Zero. Zero. Touch. No. Oh, that's just boring. You girls are boring. Yeah, okay. Fine. Yeah, okay. Maybe yeah. the world's most boring girls. Yeah, well, congratulations. Could be. Yeah. Thanks. You Thanks. won. Bye. Mm -hmm. You won. <laughs> And that was a very good example of just, you know, not saying everything you think. <laughs> Alright. I love that he gets so offended when they, they like, send him off. Like, he's so on the one track that he can't see, like, how bad he's being, which I think is pretty funny. Because they're trying to say that, like, if you're the kind of person who asks this question, that's probably what you're like, I guess. The, they do a good job with, like, I, I appreciate the, I've said this before, but like the, the, the branching storylines of this game, I actually really appreciate that aspect of it. Girls, I'm just wondering, you know, because, like, you're more blonde, but then you've got the short dress, so which one of you is sluttier? <laughs> Excuse me? Like, did you fuck more men, or she has? Uh, like she's done anal, but you do is, everything what are you else. Or... About? Why are you saying this? Well, let's say I just wanted to have sex with a girl immediately. Like that's not the case. Are you I'm sure? Looking... Go find another one. No, I will. But look, I let, will. Let's just, hypothetical. Let's just say I wanted to have sex with a girl. Get, you know, get her really drunk and take her home. Like, which one of you would be more? None. You, right? No. Yeah, that Look the way you know. She's mean. No means yes, I think. With no, you. no. No means no, and you should go. No and go? Yeah. Maybe no I means say, you should go. Maybe no, you go. I don't think maybe that's we go a good together. No. no, that's not a good no. idea. Okay, so basically you're slutty. No. <laughs> what? I've got it. Lesbians. <laughs> Oh, I knew it. bingo! I knew it. Bingo! 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 Yeah, bongo. so bye bye. Bye. <laughs> Whoa. Very good to compare girls, ask about different qualities, but not really when it comes down to sluttiness, uh, especially with girls that you've just met. They're actually very sweet. Wow. <sighs> it's hard to take like a lot of this game at the same time. It's a good thing these episodes are only, you know, a certain length. Okay, here we go. Oh, man. So, Anya, I, I don't know why, but I trust you. You seem very honest. So tell me, is she a good girl? Yes, yeah, she's a nice girl and very intelligent. Oh, oh thank you. <laughs> she's nice, yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, she's a good, good friend. friend. Right. 
instead of directly saying, you know, I like you, a nice way to do it is to bring the friend in and ask questions about the girl you like. I've seen this work all over the world and it's the right choice. All over the world. Well, that's huh? good that you were honest and told me that. Ah, uh, actually, I'm honest. Yeah. Um, I want to tell you, uh, she has a boyfriend. She has a boyfriend? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Now, this is a very tricky situation. Ask if she's going to marry him. Ask why she's talking to you then. Ask her if he satisfies her. These are all amazing. The, say she must be bored with him and... Okay, twice a week. Say that... Whoa! Whoa! None of these are good answers. Uh... Well, listen, you've got a boyfriend, right? Yep. I have this philosophy of life, you know, like you can never have too much money, yeah? Mm -hmm. Agree? And I think a girl can just never have too many dicks, so... <laughs> Oh, how about one more? No. no! No, thank you. No, because you need some variety from time no. to time. No, no, guy. You, you want to try? Give him no, a touch. No, <laughs> don't touch. touch me. Touch him. This is just so I call no. him Barry. Oh my god. Little That's Barry. Me. No. Oh man. Although Barry is, you know, wonderful, it's <laughs> something that the girl should only find out when she's proven herself special and willing. And then Barry can have all the fun that he wants. Barry. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. So you have a boyfriend? Yep. Oh, okay. How long have you been together? For like a year. Well, listen, it must be getting really boring. Wait, he, he has a job, yeah? Nine to five? Yeah. Well, I'm going to be your 2.30 man on every Tuesday and Thursday. I'll come around just... <laughs> And then, oh yeah? Yeah, out the back okay. door, leave no trace, just, <gasps> okay. well, you know, just wash the sheets and yeah. it's all good. Why not? Yeah, babe, you yeah. like that idea, yeah. huh? I like sure. it too. Sure, okay. What are you doing this Tuesday? Uh, let's just keep in touch. She's 30, yeah. right? Yeah, okay, yeah. It's going to be brilliant. Uh, yeah. She's so lucky. I'll call you. Yeah. Let's, let's go. Well, we have call to me, go. Yeah? Yeah. I'll see you. Yeah. Sure, bye. bye. Well, you have my number, right? Or... Don't comport yourself in such a manner. Comport yourself? I need to look up what that means. I don't even know what that is. Comport. Conduct oneself or behave. It must be an Englishman's thing. I mean, I obviously if it exists in American English, but maybe it's like more used in British English. I don't think any of these answers, by the way, are the right answer. Maybe we just have to get them all wrong and then it'll give us the right answer. Ask why she's talking to you then. You got a boyfriend? Yeah. Why are you talking to me then? Why not? I don't know, he's at home and you're like talking to some guy in a bar. Yeah, but I'm not the only one sitting here. She is free. Yeah, but I liked you. <laughs> but she's nice. Yeah, she's nice. Okay. <laughs> not the best oh, no. course of action here. There is a better way to do it. You know, if she has um, a boyfriend you have the choice of either leaving immediately but why not find out a bit more maybe you can be friends maybe you can move on to the other girl there's always something you can do <laughs> and challenging her in this way not the best thing oh man the fact that that even worked at all she said but she's here he said but I liked her <laughs> oh my god leave because she has a bf now i would do this but i think that this is gonna end the whole mission and i don't think we should do that ask if she thinks you could beat him up ask if he would mind you two talking i gotta see what happens with this one so your man is he is he, cause i'm kind of thinking like is he a tough guy or do you think i could take him in a fight no he's a tough guy yeah, yeah. what if i went what the <laughs> no. No? no chances. What about a little elbow? Well, and you, then can try. you can try. You can try, but you would butt. just die laughing. You headbutt, know? headbutt, hedgehog, <laughs> hedgehog. Well, that's good. Well, at least he'd die, and then we could be together. <laughs> no. So no. I win again. No. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> but no, I'm sure. I'm sure he's a very nice guy. Yes. <laughs> Save nice this one. Would no, probably no. work to be honest. Cause it's quite funny. <laughs> I, I actually did think that was pretty funny. If he didn't linger on it for so long. 
I love he he basically said like, oh, you know, we recorded this as being a wrong answer, but I think it actually might work. <laughs> I I liked that. For the record, I think that would be a good one. Ask if it, this is a pretty sensible. This has. I mean, obviously, leave is the wrong one. Okay, here we go. Well, look, I don't want to disrespect your your dude. So, uh -huh. would you mind us talking? No. Like if he was watching us right now, and we were like, he would be okay. Yeah. Yeah. If we took selfie and he saw it, be okay. Mm, yeah, I think so. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, he's kind of chilled. Yeah. 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 Nice. That's good, right? Yeah. Not too jealous. This works psychologically because you're taking away her independence. You're saying, well, would, you, would he allow you to talk to me? Like, are you allowed to do that? So she's going to want to say, of course I'm allowed. I do what I like. And, you know, our relationship's fine. We don't, you know, I'm, I'm allowed to talk to other men. She's not going to want to say, actually, I'm not allowed. And, you know, I shouldn't do it because he controls me and tells me exactly what to do. So it's the right option. The fact that he would say it, like, out loud, that you're taking away her independence is a crazy thing to say. Find out their plans for later and whether they live together, etc. Ask if they have ever kissed each other and try to get the... Okay. Okay, try this. Put your hand on my knee. Why? Stay. No, it's fine. Just knee. And put your hand on her, like, here as well, on her knee. All right, this is the thing. So... Like, while you're touching her, just start to touch me and I can look at you ah, too. No. And you can kiss her. No. Oh, come on, girl. No, that's too much, okay? No. You're not a lesbian. No, we're you not. You look like a lesbian. Why? Oh, sorry. No, we're not. You have that look in your eye. Like, you just 100% wear, straight. like you wear a strap on and have sex with women. No, no, never happen. Tonight's the night, would you say? No, <laughs> no. Because I think you should try everything once. Ah, uh, maybe, but not tonight. No. I can just sit in the cupboard and watch you guys. What about that? <laughs> no. No? No. She's finally spoken as to say no. Can you believe it? Alright, well look, you're just, um, you're very nice girls. That's good. But you're also very boring. <laughs> That's so <it's> alright. <laughs> maybe think about that. Mm, yeah, yeah, definitely. Sure. You've probably been thinking that, haven't you, before? You know, you're with two pretty girls. Right, like, here we go lesbian, threesome, blah blah blah, whatever it is. Although you think that, you don't need to vocalize it because it can be very rude, <laughs> offensive, or at a minimum, just get you blown out. You probably have been thinking that before. You know, you're with two girls. <laughs> That's what everybody's thinking. Find out their plans for later and whether they live together. Did you make any plans for later? You can go no. carry on the night? No plans. Yeah. How about tomorrow? You don't need to wake up because you're. Well, I mean, you're not working at the moment. Yeah. And yeah. do you need to open your shop early in the morning? Or yeah, you, yeah, yeah. You do. Yeah. Okay. Cool. I I don't really need to do anything, so I can stay out sleeping. Yeah, you can. We need to get catch up <laughs> some beauty sleep. Mm -hmm. I don't need it. Exactly. What? This is an important step. You're finding out important logistics that will tell you how easy it is going to be later in the evening to uh, take one or both of the girls and do something with them. Wow. I am very excited to see how this guy pulls it out of the nosedive. That was a really awkward part of the conversation. <laughs> Let me call it logistics. Okay, that uh, find the thrilling conclusion of the two girls at the bar on the next episode, ladies and gents. That's going to do it for this episode of Super Seducer. A lot of gold in this one. This is a good episode. Uh, thank you for watching. If you want to see more of this, make sure you're subscribed on the YouTube channel. These come out every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday, four times a week. I'll see you guys on the next one, and we will super seduce together. Bye-bye, everybody.